So this is a little follow-up video to the video that I did on building the charging dock out of the razor box. So as you can see in here, there's the cable. Just made a little hole for this to come out. And then there's the quick charger. So this is just a rubber insert and right here there's a stamp that kind of tells you where center is and where the cord and that plugs into the phone would be. So you just pull this out and I just took a razor knife, took a razor knife and just cut that out. Now, as far as the base goes, the bottom of this snaps off. Like so. This front corner you gotta be careful of because it's, that's the tightest part of it. But it will come apart. with your little butter knife or pry tool or something. So that's the base. Now I took a, I went and got a Samsung charging cable from Walmart for quick charge and I shaved it down. I don't know if you can see that very well, but I shaved it down so that I could bend the cable. And then I took a, it's like a multi-tool with a fine blade on it and I cut the plastic where that piece will sit I cut that plastic out and then you can see on the back here you have this for stability and I took that multi-tool and I just cut it out of there the same width as the charging plug and then I actually plugged the cable into the phone and put all this back together like so and I put the phone I, I ran this cable up and out of here plugged it into the phone put the phone back down in there and then I super glued I super glued the um, plug in there so that it doesn't move and then I just simply took and drilled a hole in this side base right here to run that cable out of and then you just take and snap this back on like so and there's your cord coming out and I'll go grab my phone so here's the razor Move you over here. Aim that down. So charging box, razor phone. Slide that down into there, and there you have turbo power connected. So down in there, that's where your accessories case goes, and you can see that wire traveling through there. When you put the accessory case in here though, it covers all that up. I can remember how to put it in there. So now there's the accessory case in there. Uh -huh. So anyway, I hope that clears up some of the questions. I know I posted this video a long time ago and I got a couple comments on it, um, but I'm not not a huge YouTuber by any stretch of the imagination. I think I have like eight, eight subscribers, so I'm coming up. Anyway, uh, I hope that helps. If you have any questions or anything, don't hesitate to drop a comment below. If you like this video and you want to see more videos of things I do, uh, go ahead, 
click that subscribe button. Thanks for watching.